Okay, now we have our final shape. Uh, what we're going to do is start decorating. So we go to Object, Path, Offset Path, and this little dialog box is going to come up. So just move this out of the way here. So if we click on Preview right away, you'll see that you get this up preview of what's going to happen if you click OK. So first of all, we're going to move this back to Mitre because we want sort of nice uh, straight edges. And we're going to work with the infill first. So we're going to go to minus one millimeter and we're going to hit tab just to preview that one that's okay so we okay that and just to make it a little bit more interesting and then say we're going to reduce the weight of the stroke so let's bring that down to about 0.5 that makes a nice light kind of stroke in there okay so just to decorate a little bit more again we're going to draw a line over here and we're going to duplicate that line about halfway up to make this bottom line a little bit thicker I think and if we hit Alt, Command and B that's going to blend those two together. Now this is obviously quite heavy just now so I'm going to go back into my blend tool here, bring up the options, specify steps, bring that down to about 20, that's a bit more interesting, a bit more pleasing now. So now what we want to do is we take the infill that we've created, copy that by pressing Command C, paste it in front by pressing Command F, and then bring that one to the front so it's on top of our blend. So select the blend and press uh, Command and 7 to create the mask. And there we have already starting to become a little bit more interesting, a little bit more pleasing again.